Hello, this is TJ from Fat Boy's Garden with an update of my spring garden. This was my squash. As you can see, it's starting to peter out. I have gotten uh, some squash out of here. And it looks like there's still a couple pieces in there that's fruiting. And uh, so in the next couple of days, looks like I might have a couple more pieces of squash to pull out of there. Now this was my disappointment. These are my cucumbers that I planted from seed. And as you can see, we got plenty of leaves, plenty of flowers, and it's growing like crazy. The problem is we have one cucumber on all of those vines. And that's about eight, maybe nine plants that I put in there. And I only have one cucumber. So my cucumbers did me no good this year. Over here, we got my okra. You know, okra is just now starting to get hot enough. Oh, wow, I see an okra. I see an okra pod over there. Did not know that. Did not know that. So we got a piece of okra over there. Over here was the beans that I finally pulled. I uh, did get some beans, but for the most part, I planted what I thought was bush beans and turns out they were pole beans because they were they were vining so i'm kind of disappointed there but i did pull them there's all of my eggplant that i grew from seed and i'm just tickled pink that it actually finally took off over here we've got my jalapenos something else that i grew from seed and we've gotten quite a few harvests out of here of the uh, jalapenos so it looks like it's time to pluck some more out of here because these are just all covered up with um, uh, jalapenos. So we got to come out here and harvest some more of those. And uh, let's see, then we're going to go over here. Uh, my tomatoes are in a separate video. Let's see, we're going to go over here to my green peppers. And these I'm not real happy with. I grew these from seed as well. And that's as tall as they've gotten. And I put those in the ground at the same time that I planted the eggplant. And you see the eggplant, how much taller it is. And this year, what I did differently is everything that produced a plant, I kind of sort of put it up here versus my leafy greens. I put them at the bottom part of my garden. So let's take a walk down there and see what we got down there. All right, first up is we've got some beets. My wife has just been absolutely enjoying the leaves from the beets. As you can see, she's been clipping them. Instead of taking the whole leaf, she's just taking the tops off of them. But yes, we've got beets in every one of these buckets. We have beets. She really hasn't eaten the beets yet. She's just been concentrating on eating the greens from the beets. So eventually she's gonna have to eat the beets themselves. Over here, we've got my Georgia collards, my top bunch collards, and my flash collards. And we've gotten quite a few harvests out of that as well, as you can see. We've gotten quite a bit out of there. Over here, I've recently planted some more peppers and they're starting to take off now. And uh, over here, before this was uh, broccoli and cauliflower, but it's since been harvested and I just put some different plants in there. And as you can see, the okra is really taking off. And then back here, we've got some more beets. And uh, this, I'm not sure what to think of this. This is Ruby Perfection cabbage and it formed a very small head, very, very small head. So I don't know if it's gonna get bigger or what, but I'm almost ready to pull those up. Um, over there, my wife went a little rambunctious with uh, pulling the leaves, so that's what we got left of that, so I'm gonna be pulling that anyway. And then over here, with some more plants that have been waiting to 
get put into a bucket, but I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon because these tomatoes are taking off. The cantaloupe is taking off. And uh, there's another, there's another tomato plant. And over there, we've got some green cabbage that when I first bought it, it said it was supposed to be cauliflower, but that don't look like cauliflower. There's the beans that I picked, pulled up out of the ground the other day. There's a couple of beans in there, but not much. I'm getting ready to throw that away. And then right here are some more plants that I've got that's just waiting to go into a bucket somewhere. So it can do its thing. Uh, looks like this might be another squash plant. Both of these are squash plants. And then down there is a cantaloupe plant, another eggplant. But these uh, cabbages are nice. Nice, firm head there. So looking forward to them uh, continuing to grow. And uh, that's going to do it for my full garden update. And hopefully we'll do another video here soon. That's going to be it for now. This is TJ from Fat Boys Garden, June the 22nd.